Hi friends, in this video I'm going to talk about what is content coupling software design principle. Coupling refers to the degree to which software components are dependent upon each other. The more they are dependent, which is very dangerous, you should not design software components which is dependent on other other modules. Okay, so you should it should be loosely coupled. There are different types of coupling, uh, data coupling, data type coupling, control coupling, content coupling. So I'm going to talk about content coupling briefly. Okay, it's a huge topic, but I'll give you a sim some uh, tips and how to avoid content coupling. Okay, content coupling is when one module module modifies or relies on the internal workings of the another module. That means they are very tightly coupled. When we change the way second module produces the data, it will affect the other module as well. So looks like two modules are tightly coupled, so the change is more. So look at this picture. If I change the module B, if these two are tightly coupled, then it will impact the module A as well. So you have to obviously change the module A as well, which is very dangerous. So you should always try to design a loosely coupled components. Cut content coupling occurs when one component modifies the data that is internal to the other component okay so which is very dangerous we should never allow any other component to change change your data okay how can we avoid content coupling you can reduce by having encapsulation you can encapsulate the, encapsulate the data first of all make the data as private and have getters and setters method so that outside modules can call getters and setters method and you decide whether to change or not please always strive hard to keep the different modules loosely coupled loosely coupled means when i change this module b it should never impact any other module outside okay so if it is affecting that means your design is not proper so always strive to design the components in a loose loosely coupled way okay hope this video is useful thank you and all the best